Hello, today is day 24 summer vacation, and not only is it day 24, it's also my first day at Penghu. This video is one of my more special videos because this video is like the first one I had this long. And also this video includes Penghu's like international fireworks show. Basically like Penghu's international fireworks show partner with like Disney to celebrate its like 100th year anniversary. Anyways, this video is about my adventures at Penghu with my family. Here's some information. Basically, my grandparents and uncle and aunt and their kid for my video at Taoyuan, along with my family and my grandparents for my mom's side and my uncle and aunt and their kids for my mom's side, went together on this trip to Penghu. I woke up at 6 and got dressed and everything, and then, like, we were driving to this place named Putai. We drove there to go to, like, this port thing, like, an airport for boats to ride to Penghu. We went an hour earlier, and my grandparents and uncle and aunt went even earlier than us. When my parents arrived, we went through security, like you do when you go to airports, and got checked and boarded on, like, the boat. So the boats aren't the kind of boats with like open like windows and stuff. It's those like kind of like airplanes. It's closed and everything. So when I boarded the boat, I found out we were going on business class. So then like we had to go to the second floor of that ginormous boat. And my seats were just like airplane seats without the TV, of course. On my seat was a bottle of water and some cookies. Basically, it's like free, I guess. Like, it comes with the seat. So we get to eat that during like the whole entire boat ride, which is like an hour and a half-ish. For kids, they also give apple juice or orange juice. I chose apple juice. And for adults, they get coffee or tea. When we arrive, we got to like this bus thing which is like the ones teachers take students on field trips. We drove to our lunch restaurant first and the restaurant wasn't like those big ones. It's just pretty small and I didn't eat too much because afterwards we get to eat like clams or something. After lunch, we went to our hotel and dropped off our bags and stuff and went to like the mall nearby. Like it's connected to the hotel. At the mall, I got toy capsules, which is like the ones you get from machines. Like you choose um, a thing or like the machine you want and you put coins in it and like you, um, what do you call it, like turn the um, switch and like a mystery capsule will come out. I chose like the Harry Potter thing. Basically it's a bag with like the Harry Potter houses. When I like um, turned it, I got Gryffindor, which is like the red one. Basically, the bag, one side says Gryffindor and the other side says Hogwarts with black background. And my grandma also wanted it, so we tried two more times. Like, we want, she wanted to get, like, Gryffindor, but we only got, like, Slytherin and Hufflepuff, I think. Because we got, like, yellow and green. We haven't opened it yet. After a little time at the mall, we had to ride this boat to this place, then board our second boat, which is going to be like the boat we eat on. So there's like this grill to me, it's very small and it just goes on your table, and you have to put up like clams and stuff, and like put it on the grill and heat it up and like cook it. Basically it's like all you can eat, so there's this big um, basket with pans and stuff and you just pick the ones you want and then you can like grill it and eat it and stuff. It was so fun, like I keep knocking on the clams because apparently if you do that, it opens faster. Now to think of it, I think those clams are like oyster or something, I'm not sure. After lunch, we were still on the boat, so then we can like go fishing or go upstairs in the second floor of the boat and play at the playground. But I did not go to the playground because it was too hot. So it's then I went fishing. Basically, I saw, like, I don't think there was any hook on, like, the fishing pole. 
so we just kept feeding the fish, I guess. So, yeah, like, we didn't catch anything. After a while, we got off the boat and went on, like, the boat back to our hotel. So when we were back at the hotel, we checked in and went to take a look at our rooms. For this video, it's more longer because of like the fireworks and everything. So like, I'm not going along with the pictures for like the audios. So after we rest a bit, we go on our second thing, which like is learning about sea creatures. Basically, we had to go with our instructor and like the group, and we go to this like lake place where it's very shallow, and we try to fish, fish, and catch like clams and um crabs and stuff it was fun and like it's also muddy though which i did not like that much then after like a couple hours we get back to like um the original place and we had to take off our boots and gloves and everything and i rinsed my feet with like the water they have there it's clean and stuff like you can literally shower there except you don't have shampoo there after that like Alyssa and my cousin got like drenched in water so they changed it and everything and we got outside of the place where we prepared to go back to the hotel but before that I got like popsicles there was two flavors available one is cactus flavor yeah you heard me right like there's literally something called cactus flavored popsicles and also peanut flavor of course just to be safe I chose peanut it tastes very good though like Apparently in Peru they have like they um plant or some like they um plant I guess peanuts and cactus. That's why they have those flavors. So it's special. After finishing the classical, we went back to like our hotel and had dinner. So like the dinner was kind of fancy. We went to this like fancy restaurant and we ate like seafood and stuff. Like, we had um, shrimps and like crabs and like fish and stuff. Like, most of like, the seafood you could think of. It was so good and all. Like, I got full like very fast because everything was so good. So, my phone was almost running out of battery, and I did not want to like lose the battery before I could take pictures and videos of like the whole entire fire show. So I got my charger and charged it at the restaurant. Yeah, like, it's so nice. It had AC there and everything. Like, it's both like private rooms here, so it didn't really matter. Since like the place where the purple firework is gonna happen, they don't allow like those big bus things that we were riding on. They're on like the roads, cause there's gonna be too much people. We had to walk from our restaurant to like that pony firework place. It wasn't that long to be honest. We walked there like 30 minutes before like the actual show. So then we get to enjoy like some like basically there's like a singer there and you have like a screen where you can sh like it shows what the singers sing and stuff. So like the people very far away can see. Like when the show started, they showed like um
So yeah, the fireworks show is over. Here's my hotel, the 7-Eleven I talked about, and all those like drinks and stuff that I was talking about. And I took some selfies and stuff too. And like this is all those candies and random stuff I was talking about. And if you watched everything to like the end of the video, thank you so much. Like I really appreciate it. I recorded this like several times because it was way too short and not long enough. But anyways, thanks for watching. Bye.